So the, the thing that really stood out to me with this next one was that uh, it kind of well it looked like it looked like a balloon to me. I mean, it looked like a uh, like a small cluster of balloons to me. But what was interesting was that uh, the two top balloons looked relatively normal, but the tether was extremely thick, and then right underneath the two balloons, it looked like. There was a blue, uh, another blue balloon, but it looked like it was actually attached to the, to the tether. You know, it actually seemed like it almost like kind of turned into a skirt. It kind of elongated and it was just kind of a strange looking type of uh, formation. And, you know, I know it's pareidolia, but take a look at the, at the white uh, the white head toward the top. Does that look like an alien to you? <laughs> looks like an alien face. So anyway, it just looks kind of, I don't know. I think it just looks kind of strange. And look how, look how big the, uh, the, the balloon, the blue balloon is now. Uh, it looks like it's elongated. It seems like it kind of shortens up at time, but it looks like it's actually absorbing the tether, which is like super thick. Look at that. That thing is like a rope. Look how thick that thing is. So, um, so the other thing I wanted to show was that with this one in particular, they had like flybys shooting right by it. And I think they're bugs, you know, but, uh, here's one, three shoot by. And then all of a sudden this orb shows up and it's flying from left to right. And not only shooting from left to right, but it's shooting upward. But it went really, really quick. It was just, it was just an amazing, it's kind of an amazing sighting. So, uh, if you take a look at it, it looked like a, look like a softball. I mean, honestly, maybe someone hit a softball up about a mile, mile and a half. If you see how it just kind of like kind of flew by, but you could see that the these bugs were not equidistant to the distant to the uh, to the balloon structure. So, just an amazing, um, just an amazing capture. And uh, here's some footage of the um, this object from the telescope. So I just tried stabilizing, uh, stabilizing it a little bit, but you could see this blue blue thing is like deflated, or it's some sort of a hitchhiker or something. It's it's hitchhiking a, like a free ride, but uh, I don't know. I'm just trying to think about you know the the possibilities versus the probabilities, and I live by the probabilities, not the possibilities. Interesting capture. Don't ask me why all these things happen all at the same time. I have no idea. Here we go. Here's here's one. It looks like <laughs> this one's like super close. Anyway, we examine it anyway. No matter what, no matter what we see, we have to examine. Even though we think, okay, it looks like a balloon. Here, this one's not that far away. Okay, what is this? Notice that it blurs out and then comes back. Notice that the arrow at the bottom left-hand corner of the screen points at the orb as it first appears. It's heading right to left, and then it hangs a U-turn and starts going back. And then watch it zip by. Notice that this appears right when the balloon object comes into focus. This is indicative of equidistance. This object is as close to the camera as the balloon-looking object. If this was some sort of a bug, you'd be able to see something. Legs, wings, something. But you don't see it here. I measured to see how fast this thing was moving. It turns out that it was moving about 12 miles per hour. So this next one looked like another softball that was hit out of the ballpark. Just an incredible... Uh, we're going to take a look at it closely in just a second. But it looked to be like like a dually, like it had two sections to it. And then it looked like it had one section to it. So, I don't know, it was a very, it was a very strange one. Uh, this one was really far. This one had to have been, geez, at least two to three miles away from us. So, um, it really wasn't that big, but just another amazing capture. Anyway, uh, this is Jay Lee from LA UFO Channel. Please, uh, you know, join LA UFO channel on meetup.com. Uh, please come to our next UFO sighting event and uh, we'll see you next time.